stop you shooting. You can see I've been playing around the box, so things are not in the same order. Neatly packed as they gave us. So this is the newest one. This is the uh, IRA. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven uh, array. I mean seven LED set system here, so you can measure uh, the uh, you know to follow tracks and so with the, with seven system you can follow uh, pretty much complicated track with different merging and turning and all that. It's of course is another dynamic so so you have a three pin there. So programming is pretty much the same way. And then uh, you have the usual bags of nuts and bolts. So what well, we got the fuse here. And nuts. And then they have the you know the usual assortment of nuts. Got some black one that probably coming to the uh, auto set. Do a smart touch small pin. Uh, the plastic insert to hold the nut in places in between part. These are handy. I like those. And then uh, just all those uh, different size screws. There is a new thing. You can see that uh, it have a. Uh, Look like a plastic insert sleeve net something. So it just have this, and then on this side it has uh, the imprint. You can see there is a nut it's supposed to be to fit in there, and then this is more like that. Finally figured out that this is the, the equivalent of the white bushing. If you have already built the bioalloy system, you remember that white bushing to use when you have. Uh, multi-link join and then you have the SB screw that you can use uh, to put right into the uh, drive shaft of the AX12 this is the equivalent of it also it comes you can see in here with some steel washers so what I did is as you can see so the uh, the bushing can go in this way actually better this way so the bushing go through and then I made one already here so we can see so that's where the steel washer goes the pan has screw goes through and on, on this side you put a nut in and you can lock it and essentially uh, you can do a pin joint very securely this way Definitely much better than the plastic rivet all of would uh, uh, you would uh, if you're using all system it's more secure talking about the rivet system they give a back of rivet and with the rivet of course we're going to need the rivet tool uh, to have the trusty screwdriver. They give a USB cable now, so you can see that you can use uh, your USB port from your PC directly. You don't have to buy the USB to dynamic so dongle anymore. But you know, the USB dynamic so dongle uh, has other things in it. Like if you want to use uh, to talk to the servo directly or to any dynamic so directly, you have to still have it. And uh, one thing I would like to request is if they could make the uh, USB to serial and use a USB connection now instead of the old 9 pin connection that would be good but that's another hardware to design spare cables uh, look like uh, three of those spare 5 pins uh, look like six of those 3 pin and a mixer thing and this one is uh, just a two pin. This is just for the uh, power line, uh, battery line, I guess. 
So it's look like it's uh, it's the same connector, so you can use lipo battery. Like if you already had a, uh, a premium bio alloy, you can just use them directly. As far as battery goes, they give us six double A with a separate cable that you can connect to it. This has a parallel board connector. Oh, this way we probably read it easier. So six of the double A can go into these six here. And then they have a little tab on this side and you can see uh, it says six volt. So you plug here, you only use the first four double A so you can six volt. And I have tested it. The CM530 will come on, uh, will power the up okay if you use six volt on it. So if you want to use all six of them, I need to plug your power cable in here to the connector and it works on 9 volt. So that works fine. And then also remember you can just put a regular lip bulb directly on it and it works too. So obviously it lasts, lasts longer. So look like you can, uh, if you need low power or for better reason trying to save on battery, maybe you do some programming if you don't move much. You can use just uh, six volt to get going, and then switch over to full power uh, of all six AA battery for actual uh, working or actual demo. CM530 look very similar to CM510, except you know yeah, you have the label, mode, start, up, down, left, right, power. Uh, fuse in the back, regular. As far as power goes, you can use the uh, power supply directly into here, the AC power supply directly here. And then you can see the uh, 2 pin Molex connector type, I guess. So you can put a, a regular LiPo here or the system that they have for 6 of the AA. And then you have uh, one of the dynamic support. This one is for the uh, either Zigbee or Bluetooth. You want to have to buy them separately, looks like. And then you have the USB uh, connection to go to the PC. Oh, by the way, uh, although USB have enough power to power this from the uh, PC itself, that feature is not available on this one. You still need to have battery here or power supply here to turn on the uh, CM530. And then you have your regular on the uh, input output on the side, two of the five pin, one dynamic so, one dynamic so, the uh, number number three, number four for the five pin, and another dynamic so, and then number five and six of the five pin, and then dynamic so. Uh, the sticker to hold the nut. I never found much use for those. And we have a little container. You can put your rippets in there. These are pulleys and other kind of parts. These are the uh, pretty much the auto part. And then we have three of the little neon for red one. This is originally all part, but you've seen it used in the uh, Bioloy PM also. Very short range, uh, much more unstable than the AX one. If you want serious uh, NIR sensor, you'd have to buy that DMS. Two servo only. You can see AX12W. Uh, outward wise, physically they look the same, same shape and everything, but it runs much faster at 470, uh, 470 RPM, so much faster. Uh, that, uh, well, well, this website didn't say anything about maximum torque, but I expect to be low. Gear ratio is very different. It's very light. You can turn now. So if you already have an AX12, AX12, when you turn, you can feel 
the gear ratio is different so it's it's very uh, harder to turn but this one is fairly easy so so very high speed but I expect the torque will be small uh, so that's why it, it's best to use them as wheels so that's the top layer, second layer is big back bag so it has sprocket that come from the Allo inventor kit and starter kit also caterpillar pieces so you can make tracks, tank tracks and then you have uh, two rubber tire look really nice two of the actual hub wheel hub and then uh, if you are using the only biolite system you recognize all these parts it's a, a regular from the Bioloid Premium or Bio Comprehensive from a long time ago. Uh, more Bioloid part type. More of them. So some more Bioloid part type, 90 degree joints. Stuff. More Bioloid type part. So these need all needs. Uh, Nuts and screws, and then mobile oil part. Uh, actually, you know this one here. You can insert the nuts in here, and these are actually you can put the rivet from the auto part. So this is a starting to have a like a mixture of uh, bio alloy and uh, bio parts together. You can use this one. And then another big box with different plate and sizes and stuff. So these are pretty much standard all -all. So this I have the they just have plain holes on and the same on either way. This is set up more for the uh, all rivet type system. Last but not least is another bag. And first if you look carefully on this side, first look like just like hole for all -all rivet also has some smaller holes you can see uh, if you flip them over the smaller holes all have inset for the hex nuts so essentially they designed this one here so you can combine uh, putting all the part together and bio part together so that means if you have you start out from all the part you, uh, the auto system like action uh, starter inventor and then you can move the bio stem. You still can use all the parts that you already have up to here. Or you can start from the biology system, or if you have an old bio system, uh, you can add them to here to get some of the uh, links and other things uh, from the auto system in here.